welcome to our Sokhtring city. As you know, Sokhtring is a small city of Sokhtring province in the far south of Vietnam. There are many Chinese Vietnamese living together with us and they remain many of their cultural traditions from the Chinese, like building temples, to worship the regional gods, offering their ancestral altars with their traditional dishes. Pia cake for the Midfall Festival is an example. It's a round-shaped cake with a sweet taste, used in worshipping Zhang Nuk, the moon goddess, in the Chinese legend. In the 17th century, pia cakes were introduced to Sok Trang by the Chinese people who immigrated to the south of Vietnam. Over the years, the cakes have been made from the plentiful material resources to the taste of Vietnamese people and have become a specialty of Sok Trang province. Along the main road to Sok Trang, it is easy for tourists to recognize a number of shops selling pia cake, a special cake that has been exiting in Sok Trang. For a long time, it is really easy to make pia cake. It is simply made from a thin layer of flour covered the core inside. The core can be made from diversified types of materials, like pork, bean, and salted yolks. Along with the development of the society, pia cake in Soktrang has been transformed in many ways with other materials to make it more delicious, like sweet potato, durin. The process to make pia cake includes many steps, and it requires skillful hands and professional method from the input to the finished cakes. Previously, the cakes were totally made by hand. However, in the early 19th century Dang Tuan, a native from Vung Thum village, present-day Futam, Chow Thun district, Sok Trang province, was the first man to make and trade the cakes, and he handed down the craft to his descendants. Needling steamed green beans they are making flour mixing machines. Firstly, flour is rolled over to create the cover. To have a thin cover with many layers, people have to process flour via many complicated steps, like stir flour together make it thin, and then roll it over. Pia cakes have a special taste with an aroma of durian fruit, the greasy and buttery flavor of salted duck eggs, and steamed green beans and Indian taras. To make delicious pia cakes, it requires many complicated steps. In terms of the cake stuffing, it is necessary to stir-fry the paste of Indian taras, ground steamed green beans, salted duck eggs with salt and the flesh of durian according to a suitable ratio, and then cover with salted duck's yolk. To make the cakes more greasy, the maker can add pork to the stuffing. The crust of the cakes is made from wheat flour. And it is also not easy to make the core of pia cake. It should be carefully done from the step of collecting materials and merging them all together to create a good taste and attractive scent for pia cake. The core of pia cake is done through the following steps. Bean or sweet potato should be well cooked, then they are ground, and then they are merged with fresh durin and salted yolks. After that, the core will be put inside the cover of the cake. Then the trademark will be stamped on the surface of the cake before they are grilled.
The cakes are baked at a temperature of 270 temperature degree for 5 to 7 minutes. Take the cakes out from the oven, upturn, and apply a layer of duck eggs yolk, and then bake the cakes again for 15 minutes, until they become yellowish brown. The cakes are round and soft with a special flavor, leaving a long-lasting taste. Pia cake should be served with tea. That is the best way to enjoy it. Eating a piece of pia cake then drinking a gulp of tea, you will feel from your tongue the bitterness of tea being dissolved with the sweetness of the cake. Pia cake in Sok Trang has now been one of the most well-known cakes in Vietnam's culture. Finally, I'd like to say that pia cakes may be a special gift for your beloved relatives and friends. Because it is not just a cake with good taste, but it is also a symbol that represents for the open and warm-hearted characteristics of Sok Trang's people.